Scapular stabilization is a really important concept to understand if you're in an occupation where you use your hands above your head a lot or you're suffering a lot of shoulder pain. Perhaps you go to the gym a lot and are getting a lot of pain around the front of your shoulders. Now, what I'm seeing a lot today is, and it's just a product of, of how we live, is everything's forward. Uh, our arms are forward working on laptops, uh, whether it we're at school, everything is forward. And what's happening is we're seeing a lot of internal rotation of the shoulder. And what I mean by that is in a normal position, the point of the shoulder should be aligned with your ear looking side on. What we're seeing a lot of now is this position where the whole shoulder blade, whole shoulder joint is rotating forward. Now it might not seem a big problem other than aesthetically, but what that does is it changes the whole mechanics of how the shoulder works. Every time you raise your arm up when the shoulder is rolled forward, this bone here obstructs and presses against the rotator cuffs. That can cause low grade inflammation, uh, can cause tears over time of these rotator cuffs. Anyone who's had a rotator cuff injury knows that it's a tedious injury and it can take a long time to heal. That's why this is crucial to understand. If you're in an occupation where you're moving your hands above your head a lot, where you're doing a lot of lifting, whether you're going to the gym a lot, stabilizing the scapula in the correct position is gonna be crucial to make sure you prevent any shoulder pain. Now, what I mean by that is when you're lifting your arm above your head, your shoulder blade should stay stable. So, so what we don't wanna see, I've got my hand against the point of my shoulder blade here, is we don't wanna see that shoulder move up like this. What we wanna see is the shoulder blade stay in the same position and the arm move up. In this position, there's no obstruction or irritation around the front of my shoulder joint. An easy way to identify whether this is something you're struggling with is to take your other hand, if possible, or get a friend to help you, push against the shoulder blade. What I want you to do is I want you to push your shoulder blade down and I want you to hold your finger against that and that's not going to move. As you do that, as you're pushing down, your arm comes up. Now, as you can see, my shoulder blade stays stable. If you're doing a lot of shoulder press at the gym, any shoulder exercises, this is gonna be something that I want you to be really mindful of. The best way to set the shoulders or put them in the right position is imagine you're squeezing an apple in between your shoulder blades. Hold it and then move your arms up. Hopefully this gives a bit of clarity around that. If you have any questions, please let me know. Personally, this is something I've struggled with and I've had to work really hard to make sure I eliminate the stress and the inflammation on my shoulders as I'm adjusting throughout the day. So please let me know if you have any questions.